Let's go. Kim, we are we are cooking up a storm here, Jessica. In the Nine News Now kitchen, we have Zed Wondemo and Tom Wondemo, the sister brother team. She's from Zed's Bistro and Wine Bar, located in the heart of Georgetown. And Zed specializes in Ethiopian cuisine. Welcome. It's so nice to have you guys here. Thank you very much. I'm sure. kind of a newbie to Ethiopian cuisine. I live in Frederick. We have a, a nice restaurant up there. I was introduced to your wonderful, I mean, so many different flavors. Tell us about the background that goes into the cooking. Well, uh, everything starts fresh. You know, we use fresh ingredients, mm -hmm. fresh meat, fresh chicken. Everything is washed yes. and removed. All the fat is removed. Okay. So the, it's time consuming. It takes a lot of time to prepare Ethiopian dishes. Tell me about the bread that on, upon which it sits. The bread is, uh, we call it injera. Yeah. It's from a special uh, grain. TEF, T E F F. It's the smallest grain. Right. And there is a fermentation process. It's natural fermentation. It's kind of sponge like, but it's perfect because all of the different meals you put on there, it absorbs the flavors. And the best part <laughs> is at the end of the meal, I think the next day, eating the leftovers because <laughs> it's so good. It tastes good. All the spice soaked in and the injera. Oh, so look at all of the spices you have here. Can you tell us uh, some of the things you cook? Yeah, with? this is a uh, red chili paper, Ethiopian chili paper. Okay. It already has a different kind of spices. Mm -hmm. And then uh, fresh rosemary leaves. Okay. Fresh garlic. Mm. It smells so good smells so good yes and it's also this is a another type of chili paper it's very very hot oh my. and this is my favorite spice cardamom oh, it doesn't it? yeah it doesn't require it's just like perfume here yeah? mm, it doesn't require good, yes. a lot and is that and, pepper yeah pepper and okay. you know as you see because is this sugar no no that's uh, salt Oh, it is? Okay. Yeah. <laughs> and we, didn't, we, we didn't bring everything because, right. you know, there's only so much time. Traveling. What are you and, making today? And I'm making uh, beef sauteed. Okay. And it's onion mm -hmm. and olive oil, little olive oil. Right. And you put your skillet high and then we put uh, already the... Uh, Oh, you know how to cook. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> we put a uh, little uh, marinated beef. Mm. It's already garlic. I see the rosemary. This and smells rose wonderful. Oh. As you're cooking this up for us, tell us what it's like to go. If uh, people at home haven't been to an Ethiopian restaurant, I really liked uh, what what it was like. It was very communal. Yes, uh, it's a sharing experience all the time, as they say in Ethiopia. Uh -huh. If you eat together, you don't betray. Oh, each, each other. So it has meaning. So Very good. Food, you know, because you don't eat food right. with, with everyone. It has right. to be somebody special. Maybe so. you should eat with your enemies, and that would be a really good thing. That's right. You know? <laughs> and then you become friends, right? That's right. That's and right. It's a sharing experience. You see, you know, different kind of foods. When you come to the restaurant, yeah. you know, as you know, we have two restaurants. One is in Georgetown. Right, where's the other? 21 years. Uh, the one in Georgetown is Zed's uh -huh. Ethiopian Cuisine. Uh -huh. The one in Gainesville is Zed's Bistro and Wine Bar. And where does Tom fit in here? Your brother. Okay. I'm in Gainesville. He's in, uh, in Gainesville. Uh, Very yes. good, so you're yes. handling that. Yeah. 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 Well, welcome to the family business, I guess. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you very much. Thank you. Uh -huh. Thank you. We very have much. about 30 seconds. Can you quickly just tell me some of the other dishes you have on the platter? Yes. Uh, like, what's this one over here? It's the beets. Okay, that's red beets. Okay. And, and then this with the egg, egg is interesting. Yeah, this chicken and uh, 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 one uh, uh, chicken leg okay. with a sauce. We're getting a quick wrap, but don't worry. We're okay. going to take just a quick commercial break because we need to get back here and sample your wonderful food from Zed's uh, e Ethiopian Cuisine, Zed's Bistro and Wine Bar in Georgetown. We will be right back. You are watching 9 News Now. Good morning. I want to thank all of our guests this morning for participating in this Mind Over Money Friday. Our next edition will begin next week on Friday. And we're going to head it over to Kim for oh, last weather. I'm getting lessons on uh, how to use the Me bread too. to break it off and scoop it up. Uh, mm. Weather-wise, you probably want to know. We're going to get some showers, a couple of thunderstorms oh, into everything. the afternoon. Temperatures in the mid-60s. Just scoop it all, Angie Goff. Mm. And a nice Easter Sunday, everybody. We want to thank our guests, right? We do, for the Mind Over Money segment. And uh, we want to thank you for staying with Nine News Now this morning at noon. 
Uh, we're going to have JC, who's going to be along. And for news anytime, go to WUSA9.com. Mm -hmm. Have a great weekend, guys. And don't forget, Zed's oh, Bistro and Wine Bar in Georgetown. We love you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Coming in. Thank you very much. Thank Bye, everybody. Bye-bye. Yes, we will. We will. Okay. Watch the best in sports.